Of all the things we learned about the monster wolf that's been stalking LA, the most interesting to me is how it got that way. We've learned over the first half of the first wolf pack season that werewolves in this universe can be either wolves, like the Cubs Ranger Briggs found and brought home all those years ago, or they can be human shaped, which is the form that Luna and Harlan took shortly after they were found. There is this thing where the human shaped grow fangs and claws and get the glowy eyes, but that's still mainly human shaped and nothing, nothing at all like this big boy. We learned in episode six that Biggin got this way because it got burned in the wildfire. We dragged it as close to the fire line as we could. Watch the flames take over. That's when it died? No. That's when it changed. You saying the fire turned the wolf into a werewolf? Maybe the fire took it from one shape to another. So if that bit is true, we may have what is a brand new werewolf myth. I did some research. That means I did a couple of hours of Googling and an hour probing chat GPT, and neither I nor the AI could find any reference to fire making a regular werewolf into a monster. There were some false starts with our future digital overlord. It thought it had found something where a loop guru becomes a more monstrous rougarou through the application of fire, but that turned out to be erroneous, a glitch in its matrix, I guess. I can find nothing mentioned anywhere in the vast archives of the planet. So it appears that Jeff Davis has created an entirely new folklore for his brand new werewolf universe. And I, for one, am very interested to see where this goes. Wolfpack streams new episodes on Thursdays on Paramount+.